My name is Atomic Robson. Welcome back to Rhapsody. Uh, right. I'm pretty sure we've already... Yeah, no, we've already set up everything except for, I guess, our new weapon. Hmm. Don't need extra bridge materials right now. Or do I? I don't want to go for the Flying Squirrel, and I also don't want to go for the Blunderbuss. So maybe I'm farming all of today, because these are really garbage weapons. If I'm farming all of today, I could take two Tundra Seeds and try and go for that. Yeah, I'm going to farm today. And probably just save my money. Yeah, I'll just save my money for the next season. Well, not next season, but next day. So my goal here has to be basically what? Just rid all of these plants off the area and then a Nemen crew? And then a Nemen crew? And then a Nemen crew? I really wish I had something that would make them grow faster at the moment, but Yeah. If ifs and buts were candy and nuts, we'd all have a happy Christmas. There's the psychoactive weeds working for us. So all of the little things that get spawned on the floor, I believe, are just the effects of the psychoactive weeds, and then we pick them up and start triggering the impact. Wait. I mean, the farm is kind of taking care of itself at the moment. Hmm. It's a shame we don't really have much else that we can do. Really would like anything that would hasten the growth of these crops at all i'll even take the benefit that uh that makes the crops only grow as i'm standing next to them i'd do that happily anything's better than just waiting for the extremely slow ones to finish up You know what? I'm using my first amendment creed. I'm not, I'm not waiting a billion years in order to get the first one off and then still have to do a game for the second and third. Heck, there's probably no reason for me to really be here right now. These are all gonna be watered by the cows. I'm not even significantly hastening this by standing here myself. I do need the money. I may actually try and save up a thousand at the end of the season so I can gamble, because I've never done that one. There's a thousand cost for a gamble. I'd kind of like to see what we get. Check ready again. So it's actually kind of fun because the tractor cuts the weeds and the weeds do damage to all enemies because the razor weeds. So I can use it, especially if there's a boss like standing among a bunch of weeds. I can just use it to kill them all. It's going to be a good time. Guess I start planning my own as well. Thanks. Thankfully, I have dealt with enough consistently firing enemies in Gungeon to know you circle strafe and you never stop. Well, not least it's dead. I'll stick around for the rest of the day. Because these crops aren't actually defending themselves as much as I might like with the turrets. Maybe I just have them poorly positioned. I kind of just... I don't really worry too much about the positioning of any of these kinds of things. Because the longer that I spend worrying about the positioning of like extremely minute effects, the... It's, it's just like a waste of time, and time is like one of the most valuable resources that you have. 
So it seems like suboptimal but quick is better. <sighs> yeah, it wasn't even that much money to dedicate a whole day to. Rusty SMG. It's real good. I can take that in two upgrades and start go exploring. I'm gonna do it. And then I'll also take one more bridge building material. Ah, oh, That's what I wanted, the stats up. Shame I'm just a rose short. Immediately start heading south. So I got extra damage twice over and range and accuracy. This is perfect. This should be a pretty, pretty effort. Oh! Dang it. Walk directly into that one myself. Uh, this should be a pretty effortless clear of this area. It's a shame that... That had to happen exactly as I was intimating that I was not going to be taking damage, but you know. If I was ever going to take damage, it would be during that statement. <laughs> oh, come on! And immediately thereafter as well, apparently. Alright, I need to play a bit more carefully here. I don't want to have to spend any of my roses just getting HP back. Such a waste. Especially when I'm still looking to get married. Oh, I did not know you were still around. Yikes. Enemies, please. Uh, Double-edged watering can? Mm. Turrets water near my crops. Okay, never mind. Now we do need to focus on the positioning of the turrets. Rain cloud. Thank you. All right, I'm going back to town. I'm, I'm going to finish all of my harvests right now. All I needed was a rain cloud. Oh, how lovely! Mm -hmm. Put that down and try and get the quick rest of these turnips out. No, nope, I'm just gonna end them pretty quickly. Start trying to expand the hard crust as well. And especially try and get these roses down. It's a decent amount of loot. We've still got the rain cloud for like another 40 seconds or something, so. Let's try and get another anemone tree down. So I thought I was going to be doing significantly more exploring than I ended up doing today. It's a little disheartening. And I also haven't really used any of these scrolls super effectively. But I'd rather have them used than not. And it's difficult to get that much usage out of, you know, the three anemone Cree that I had at the same time. Yikes! No, 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 no! I don't like the cherry bombs that just follow you because they take so many hits and don't even give you anything. Such a hassle. Sorry, long range friend. You just have to die. I can't have you messing with me. In particular, the speed of the shot is the thing that makes me constantly focus on them quickly. Just because you have to kind of proactively dodge it, rather than just rely on muscle reflexes of seeing something coming towards me and going, Oh yeah, I'll deal with that. <laughs> just slightly strafe out of the way. Let's 
get another tree down, I guess. Alright. I mean, the day could have been worse. The day could have been significantly worse. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't go harvesting today, so... Basically, I'll let the rest of these crops grow. I'll come back at midnight, and then I'll harvest them. Uh, also, this is another boss day, so... Oh, perfect! Sniper rifle double upgrade, thank you. Hit clip size both times. I don't know if I'm actually infused to hit clip size both times. I definitely don't need another upgrade, though, so... Hold off on that. <gasps> Horse! Run faster after short period out of combat or farming. I'll take that. And then... Do I... Yeah, I'm going to increase our relationship just to get HP right now because I am kind of scared. So, 10 more roses and I can get married again. Night. Night. I'll take the tier 2 desert seeds as well. And bounce. All right, I actually should also just plant the rest of these before I leave. Because, <laughs> gosh, we have a lot of them. Okay. Also, I think the chilies take, like, ages to grow, so you should be able to ignore them for a while. Hey. Come on. God, get the rest of these out of my inventory. I should also replace those turrets. That's a future Ryan problem, I think. Just way, way too many seeds. So, how did I end up with this many seeds? I guess, like, the Weed Whacker Tractor has done a significant amount of it. It feels like there's never a reason, at the very least in my experience playing the game, to buy seeds. Because it always just feels like you get enough from the exploration. Okay. And, yeah, you know what? Nothing else I can really do here right now. Peace. This extra speed is just so damned useful. Especially at nighttime, it's going to allow me to get back to my farm so that I can actually defend it at a reasonable pace. Kill missile, chicken seeds give eggs, thank you. Oh, sorry, chicken eggs give seeds. Almost the direct inverse. Hey, new golden chest, thank you. Can I go kill it in time? Yep. And I even got organic armor, hell yes. Oh, perfect time to have picked it up as well. Come on. Oh, did you see how that shredded the HP of old McDonald? That's exactly the point I was trying to make previous. Oh, gosh. Actually, have completely different attacks. Neat. But yeah, all it had to do was stand in the middle of a bunch of weeds and then just ruined its life. Ah, almost walked into that raspberry. Damn it. I knew it was going to be difficult to actually weave my way in between those bullets, but I still wanted to try. Excellent. This day could really have scarcely gone better. The only hit that we've taken was against organic armor, so we don't actually have to lose any HP. Or rather, we don't have to use any of our roses to get any HP back. I didn't think I was inside that area of effects for the bomb, but you know, I guess the game disagrees.
Can... Can I just give all the rest of these seeds to someone else to plant for me? It's taking way too long. Also, I'm not fertilizing almost any of these. <sighs> Alright, so I've taken two more hits now. Thanks, game. I really thought we were going to be able to clear this up day. Have a good time, but no. You have to constantly try and murder me. It's almost like that's integral to the gameplay loop. Taking these, thank you. Eh, decent amount. Could have divided by 10. Would have had a lot more. Let's go up for the definite full ceremony here. Good. Ooh, that's three cornucopias. Well, we have to get another cat at the end of this run. Okay, we extremely overshot what we needed there. Uh, double edge watering can, finally. Oh, ooh, a rain cloud as well. Yes. That's probably the biggest thing that we got. Uh, stats up. I really wish I could take that, but I have no roses at the moment. It's also whiskey shot damage. Uh, sorry, taking damage reduces the tractor cooldown. I don't think that's particularly important for us. Uh, I'm not going to get a second tractor. And let's gamble. Okay. So I gambled and I got a cornucopia. Um. Alright. The game seems to value cornucopias, like, a lot more than I do right now, because they don't do anything. Mm. I'm just gonna try and focus on getting my second marriage done. Uh, shotgun, upgrade, upgrade. So we got clip size and back gun. That's really garbage! This shotgun isn't good offensively, and I'm about to go into, like, the areas that are significantly more difficult. I don't like that at all. Let's try and get all of the rest of these down. And then I'll pop down that rain cloud. I'm going to start them. Beautiful. Just way too many seeds. Right. So I should be focusing exclusively on getting the roses down. That would be the clever thing to do. Anyway, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I don't want to give anyone the impression I'm clever. We are almost done with the farming phase of today. But this should basically, off of the back of today, we should be able to guarantee the whole season is really good for us. Perfect. That's two roses. Still need eight more now. Three, seven. I feel like I am going to have to explore in order to find more roses to plant, so. Still going to get back to doing that soon. Alright. Tractor over here. Just to get myself some extra resources with which to work. Maybe I just need to try and increase my fighting stats through purchases and stuff like that. Because 
clearly, purchasing weapons isn't always good. You don't always get offered a weapon worthwhile. And although that might indicate... Oh, okay, you probably don't want to be doing that many weapon-based things today. I still need weapons to defend my camp. I can easily see myself, like, dying tonight. <laughs> Stop. I am so pleased that we have this drone... Uh, sorry, these two drones and the drone upgrade. Without that, we would have already been lost. Without that, life would be violent and all would be lost. All right, I can't continue planning things right now. It's too hectic. Gosh! Stop! <laughs> Stop it, snipers! God, there's more snipers than almost every other enemy right now. That's not even to say anything about the bombers. All right. Great. Feeling a lot more comfortable again. Rest of the available loot. I'm going to say 800. Woohoo! 991. Not bad. Uh, Jackrabbit plus two upgrades sounds like a great idea right now. The problem is I'm probably not going to get that much money today. Because I intend to explore. Which means that I need to find another way to get enough money for a good weapon tomorrow as well. Oof. It feels like my priorities are... Split poorly. But to get rake loot magnet. Oh, I didn't even know there was one of those. That's the most important thing. You know how much time you would save? Damn it. I'm not even going to be able to pick it up. Jackrabbit, upgrade, upgrade. Clip size and bullets. That's a really good gun. <laughs> uh, it's just the blunderbuss and the shotgun that I think I don't like. Actually, as well as the squirrel. Because uh, the squirrel is like a missile launcher and the squirrels are the missiles. But the speed at which they move is so glacial that you will never hit anything with them. Okay. Now, I finished exploring south, right? Yeah, we finished exploring the south. Now I've got to go to one of the ones that's going to cost me two bridge building materials. So over here. Now you can see the shot speed of the enemies has been severely increased. That's, that's a rough time for us. Especially because my turrets actually water crops. There was no reason to go for the cow there. Unless I start getting some benefits that benefit the cow. We're pretty much done with them. Cleats, till soil by stepping on it, or turrets and drones fire faster. Well, yeah, no... Yeah, no, I gotta go for that one. I really wanted to have the ability to till the soil just by walking on it, because that would save us so much time. But, sorry, the faster firing is way, way more important. So those holes, my understanding is they will just teleport me straight back to my base. I don't really need to go back to my base right now, so... I'm just gonna... Oh, what?! 
All right, one of the enemies straight up bent it like Beckham. I don't know if I was supposed to take that shot. That one was actually probably fair and I just wasn't looking at it though. <laughs> Rain cloud. I think like the biggest bottleneck is we need someone to help us plant seeds. I'm gonna go back to... Ooh. I'm gonna try and loot this camp before we leave just because it could be really good for us. Turret growth aura. Yep. And then peace. All right. I don't know when we're going to be able to find the time to put down our turrets correctly. So let's start doing it right now. Uh huh. I'm going to leave the super turret where it currently is. And then I'm going to start putting these turrets around. Oh, what? All right. I, again, I, I can't start putting them down. Way, way too many enemies doing way, way too much annoying stuff right now. <sighs> yeah, I hope that it's only a year in terms of duration because otherwise I am not going to be able to keep up with this level of difficulty, especially on this run. I'm going to have to do some learning. Oh, no. At the very least, I do have the ability to run away quite effectively. Okay. What? That turret pushed the bomb into me. That's so rude. Go back to base, I guess. Yeah, the loot today was garbage. Sniper rifle, upgrade, upgrade, thank you. <laughs> In the next episode, we're gonna face what might be the final boss of this current game's incarnation. For the moment, my name is Rhapsody, the name of the game has been Atomic Rops. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves and hopefully we'll see you next time.